Hi guys. Hi. So this makes it a little bit different, isn't it? <laughs> yep. So just a short one to uh, fill you in and to give you a bit more of a teaser. So we've had a lot of people, you know, putting a bit of, I don't know, ex their own excitement on us uh, because they want to see the boat, they want to see the, the car and um, it's all back. I've got it. Yeah. I'm looking at it right now. No. <laughs> uh, it looks, we're pretty stoked with it. It's been a bit of a, a little bit of a long road, not as long as, as, as some most. Some people, but yeah. But um, we've been pretty fortunate. But yeah, we've had some great people working with us. A massive shout out to Jake from Concept Canopies and Dean from Big Dog Builds. Uh, the car looks incredible. We've also got it sign plastered, which we weren't really sure if we we're going to do, but we've I done know. it. I was a bit nervous about that. Yeah. I don't know how I feel, but I think it looks good. I um, think it looks good. I yeah, just, buddy. I, I don't know. I just don't like being like real showy, and it is, but it suits the truck. So. I mean, I stick out enough. I don't. I don't need every, like the truck <laughs> I'm driving to be sticking out too. Yeah. But um, I don't know. It's sort of hard to not stick out if you're an f-350 it's also hard not to stick out if you're a six Sorry. foot seven bloke so um yeah. anyway we'll uh give you a bit of a bit of a squeeze yep and uh a full run through of the truck is coming uh just Soon. be patient <laughs> yeah so we don't have much time now because we're getting ready to hit the road and we're packing everything and sorting everything but we wanted to give you a little quick video and just give you a little sneak peek of the car the canopy and the boat um so hopefully <laughs> you enjoy that we'll give you a bit of a squeeze yep There it is. <laughs> How good does that look? Like I'm having, I'm having a little bit of a love affair with this full bar. Okay, so the whole thing's done. We've, uh, it's been, what, seven weeks from how you saw it before, insert photo here, to how this looks now. And um, it's been worth the wait. It wasn't in the middle of it. <laughs> I was just getting withdrawals, but um, we are absolutely stoked. Uh, so let's have a quick walk around, show you the boat. I'll show you the top of the whole rig, uh, and I will insert some photos of what the boat looks like on the roof shortly. And I'll give you a look at the canopy. 
it's like the pièce de résistance for us. It's not the flashiest thing out there, but we're just not that flashy. So this suits us, but it's super duper flashy for us. We're thrilled. So let's have a look. Alrighty. So this is the canopy. Who's these guys? Anyway, so this is us, in case you were wondering, and I'll give you a bit, a bit of a squeeze of the canopy. So the, it's not fully packed yet. It's not exactly 100%, but it's very close. And I'm only gonna show you this one side because I don't wanna ruin what I've got planned. So, are you ready? Because it's gonna be quick. Ready? Ready? Ha <laughs> ha No, there you go. All right, so without doing a full walkthrough, fridge, because we already had it, uh, we don't have the, the, the fridge as a fridge, we have the fridge as a freezer. So it made no sense in getting an upright fridge uh, to us, and it's just an extra food carrying. It's not necessarily a fridge. You can use it as a fridge, but we use it predominantly as a freezer. Um, the guys at Concept, Jake and the boys, did a ripper job. You know, they've they bent over backwards for us, and I just love the... bench <laughs> uh, it's got the full electrical setup we will be replacing our inverter um, so it, like I said it's not a hundred percent complete just yet but it's close once we get that done pretty much be ready to rock and roll fully won't we all right so me rods I don't have them just sort of tucked behind the box, behind the back seat anymore. The Suzuki uh, 20 horsepower outboard motor, full power. It's so good. I've never had an outboard like that before. Uh, we took it out a little while ago to do a bit of a run and my father-in-law and I, and it was, I've never used one before on a tinny. On my dad's boat, yeah, sure, but that was a mid console. Uh, so good, like just taking the hard work out of it, you know. Anyway, moving on because I don't want to take up too much time. Close this up. Love that. There's no double latches, and all well, the whale tail handles look pretty good and all that, but <sighs> so good. Alrighty, so this is our 375 Mako Craft Topper Tracker. And they are very, very popular. We were looking at brand new, and boy, COVID really did a number on the whole market. It's just ridiculous. It's just gone through the roof, could not see the sense in paying well for this setup so for this boat for, for a similar trailer outboard floor uh sounder and a few of the little bits and pieces like i've got some rail blades or accessories you wouldn't get much change out of 20 grand so that's brand new and <sighs> that was going to sting quite a lot I just got on boat sales and this absolute champion of a bloke, Wayne, you are just so good, mate. You were you're, you're brilliant. Um, and w I picked up Wayne's old rig and he was sort of done with his travels. He wants to head, head overseas. So I'm like, beautiful. It's <laughs> all right. Full transparency, the whole the, the whole get up, you know, under thirteen grand. So it's a lot better than paying twenty. <laughs> so I am thrilled at that. 
I, I, yeah, I'm just thrilled. So we've got the full vinyl wrapping. And that's about it. That's all I'm going to sort of really show you of the boat at the moment. Uh, I just wanted to sort of show you what, we, what we've been up to. All this has been working in the background. We've been busy here at the property, so we've been flat out. But, um, yeah, here it is, guys. So watch out for us on the road. We'll be on the road in the next oh, week and a bit. So we'll be heading north. And uh, if you're in sort of the, well, greater Queensland region, <laughs> not giving too much away, uh, don't be shy. Come up and say hello. And, um, yeah, see you out there.